or he's an specialist in drawings and, and, and so I'm, I'm very bad, uh, you know, doing this kind of thing. But I can explain to you, okay? Then, this is a sending aorta artery over here. Okay, the aortic arch. And this is the descending aorta artery. Uh, That's okay. a long row. Descending aorta artery. That is gonna be located posteriorly in the thorax and go very close to the, uh, you can say the anterior part, talking about the, the, the location and everything anteriorly to the the one of the vertebrae that are at the front of the vertebrae the body vertebrae bodies okay running all over giving some tributary arteries along the way and so on but focusing that this is the right part and this is the left part right okay no left Okay, then in the aortic arch, we're gonna have the first, the first arteries that are rising, they are arising from the, from the ascending aorta at the root of the aorta are the coronary arteries, the right and left coronary arteries, right? Then in the aortic arch, we're gonna see at the right part, the brachiocephalic trunk. The brachiocephalic trunk is gonna give origin, is gonna give origin to the rhizoclavian artery and the common carotid artery. From the common carotid artery, we're gonna have external and internal carotid artery. And we study already that the internal carotid artery form part of what type of circulation of the brain? Anterior circulation of the brain. Part of the Willis circle, remember? Okay? Then we continue. And now we're gonna have what? The common carotid artery, but we need to use a family name for this. That is the left common carotid artery. That is gonna be subdivided into internal carotid artery, making part of the blood circulation in the eye and the brain with a circle, and the external carotid artery to blood supply, rich oxygen blood supply the part of the face and the neck, right? Then we have what? The left subclavian artery. Left subclavian artery is gonna go to the, to the left arm left arm, okay? And the rise of if the rise of clavian artery, remember that is living longer because, because we need to go to the brachiocephalic trunk first and then the rise of clavian artery. And that's why when you measure the blood pressure in the right arm, is comparing to the left arm is what? Here is lower and here is higher. Pathologies, we're gonna talk about this. You have plenty of time, okay? Plenty of time, but you need to know the normal first. You need to introduce yourself in learning, memorizing, loving the normal things, okay? And that's it because I'm, I'm ugly and I don't want to. Okay, and this is the des descending aorta. Huh? Thoracic, abdominal aorta, and all the tributaries, all the plexus.